IIT Madras 2022. IIT Madras, one of the finest and reputed institutions in India, is recognized globally. IIT Madras ranks number four in best global universities in India and ranks number 138 in best global universities in Asia, as well as ranks number 633 in best global universities according to usnews.com and is also consistently ranked at number one by the NIRF in the engineering category since 2017. This is a post from your favorite education guide, College Suggest. Know your course, know your career. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite courses and careers. In this video, we're going to give you a review of IIT Madras for 2022 and compare statistics over the past three years of student intake rates courses offered, graduation and placement information, infrastructure, and other factors about the prestigious university. Keep watching to know more. IIT Madras was established in 1959 and has been recognized as one of the top-notch universities in India. Located in Chennai with a 640-acre beautiful campus, it is one of the institutes of national importance in higher technological education. It has 16 departments and a few advanced research centers with the latest lab equipment. IIT Madras offers 9 UG courses, 31 PG courses and 25 dual degree courses. Now let's delve into details about the statistics of student intake for the past 3 years for various programs offered. We're showing the approved student intake data submitted to the NIRF by IIT Madras for this academic year. From the data, it is clear that the rate of students taken in for the UG four-year program for 2022 is 877, for 2021 it was 762, and in 2020 it was 488. There has been a 79.7131% increase in approved student intake in 2022 when compared to 2020. Whereas for the UG 5-year program offered at IIT Madras, the sanctioned student intake for 2022 is 177. In 2021, it was 157 and in 2020, it was 358. There is a 50.5587% decrease in the intake rate for the academic year 2022 compared to that of 2020. Now let's take a look at the student stats info of IIT Madras. For any institution, the student community is a big strength. IIT Madras accommodates a total of 6,272 students pursuing all the degree programs. The percentage of male community stands at 83.59% and girls pursuing a degree at IIT Madras comprises a total of 16.41%. Now let's take a look at the distribution of the students based on their locations who are studying at IIT Madras. Among the total of 6,272 students, 1,028 are from within the state, whereas 5,190 are from outside the state and 54 are from outside the country. Now let's take a look at the information about graduation percentage of students for the past three years. With the onset of the pandemic, a lot of changes have been introduced in the education sector, where most of the classes were conducted online and students had to face many hardships due to sudden changes. However, the graduation rates of IIT Madras have been impressive and increasing when compared to 2020, which clearly shows that the students have shown a lot of dedication and put in a lot of hard work to successfully graduate in spite of a lot of the shortcomings along the way. For the academic year 2020, the graduation percentage for UG programs was 79.04%. For 2021, it was 80.43% and for 2022, it has increased significantly to 89.42%. The graduation percentage for dual degree for 2020 was 86.26%. For 2021, it was 91.33% and for 2022, it is 95%. For the academic year 2022, the total number of PhD students admitted is 2,204 and 205 students successfully completed their doctoral degree and graduated. Let's take a look at placement percentage records for various degree programs at the IIT Madras campus. The students in IIT Madras have gotten jobs in distinguished and reputed companies with a good salary package. Let's look into those statistics right now. The placement percentage rate for the UG students in 2022 was 90.97%. 
In 2021, it was 86.41%, and in 2020, it was 90.24%. For dual degree candidates, the placement percentage rates for 2022 is 91.69%. For 21, it was 90.18% and in 2020, it was 86.64%. All of this data indicates that in 2022, for all the degree programs, the rate of placement percentage has increased when compared to 2020. Next, we're going to look into the data related to median salary packages received by students at IIT Madras over the past three years. Students who pursued their UG four-year programs received a median salary package of 15 lakhs in 2021 and in 2022, whereas in 2020, it was 13 lakh 60,000, which is a 10.29% increase over the two years. For a UG five-year program, in 2022, the median salary package of students who attended placement was 15 lakh 50,000, Whereas in 2021, the students were offered a slightly higher remuneration of 16 lakhs. But in 2020, students received a salary package of 13 lakh 50,000. Compared to 2020, it was a 14.81% increase in the salary package for students in 2022. Now let's take a look at the capital expenditure data for the academic year 2022. The total amount utilized for academic activities and resources, which includes purchases made by the library, buying new equipment for research labs, conducting engineering workshops, and creation of capital assets, sums up to 174.8 crores in 2022. From the total sum, 12.14% of the amount was spent on library resources and 84.24% was spent in purchasing new equipment for labs while 0.2% was used in organizing workshops, seminars, and conferences. And 3.35% was utilized for building classrooms, seminar halls, and conference halls. And looking at the previous three years' data, the amount spent on libraries has increased, which is a positive sign that more books are being added to the library collection, which will in turn aid the students. In terms of buying new equipment for the academic year 2022, IIT Madras has spent 28.26% less than what they spent in 2020. For organizing engineering workshops, the amount spent by IIT Madras has slightly increased by 11.87% in 2022 when compared to 2020. In terms of capital assets in 2021, IIT Madras had spent nearly four times the amount spent in 2020 and 2022. Now let's explore the operational expenditure done by IIT Madras. The total amount spent for operational expenses for the academic year 2022 is 1,019 crores. Out of this, 54.05% was spent towards the salaries of teaching and non-teaching staff. 44.86% was spent for maintenance of academic infrastructure and other running expenditures and 1.09% was spent on organizing seminars, conferences, and workshops. And looking at the previous three years' data, the amount has increased, which is a positive sign. Let's take a look at the patents-related data. IIT Madras is a technologically well-equipped institution, and a lot of startups have been started from the alumni or faculty. It is no wonder that this institution has a high rate of patents published every year. In 2020, a total of 207 patents were published and 113 patents were successfully granted. In 2019, a total of 146 patents were published and 53 patents were granted. In 2018, a total of 123 patents were published and 46 were granted. This data indicates that every year, there's an increase in the number of patents getting published and granted from IIT Madras. Now let's take a look at the details about sponsored research funds. IIT Madras has been the forerunner in promoting sponsored research projects, where they receive funds either from government agencies or industries in developing new products. For the academic year 2022, IIT Madras has received a total of rupees 400 crores from 91 different funding agencies for a total of 777 sponsored projects. For 2021, they received a total of Rs. 389 crores from 97 funding agencies for 605 sponsored projects. For 2020, IIT Madras received a total of 521 crores from 64 funding agencies for a total of 575 sponsored projects. IIT Madras is receiving a huge amount of funds to develop products. 
Now let's take a look at the consultancy project details. For the academic year 2022, IIT Madras has received a total of Rs 176 crores from a total of 572 client organizations for 866 consultancy projects. For 2021, IITM received a total of Rs 171 crores from 526 client organizations for 943 projects. For 2020, they received a total of Rs 136 crores from 413 clients for 867 projects. Compared to 2020, there has been an increase of 28.61% in the total amount received in 2022. And compared with 2021, there is an increase of 2.54% in the total amount. Now let's take a look at the faculty data as well as the fee structure. IIT Madras comprises a total of 645 faculty members, out of which 99.84% are PhD holders. The faculty to student ratio is 1 is to 8. The approximate first semester fee for a student studying a UG course at IIT Madras is Rs. 1,4100. And the approximate average total fee for completing the degree costs Rs. 8,7000. Please note that the fee structure mentioned is subject to variation. IIT Madras is a renowned institution in India and a lot of students aspire to study in this institution. One of the emerging ideas of IIT Madras is giving a push to translation research where ideas get transformed to products. IITM Research Park was established where a lot of spin-offs and startups are starting to operate from this research park which aims to meet the needs of the society. One of the main strengths of this institution is highly skilled faculty. We have also shown that the data related to graduation percentage and placement details, which clearly indicate the institution is continuously progressing. IITs have an impressive record for the salary packages offered to their graduating students, and IIT Madras also has good records for the same. We hope that we've given you all the insights about IIT Madras for the academic year 2022. What is the course that you want to pursue next? Tell us and we will provide all of the information that you need to prove your decision right. If you agree with our analysis, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and for more information, visit collegesuggest.com.